Hey guys, my name is Isabella and welcome to my channel. Before we get into today's video, I just want to remind everyone about a couple of things. First, my Patreon, where for $3 a month you can get four extra ASMR videos each and every month. You will also gain access to all of the previous month's videos as well. I also have an OnlyFans page, so if you think that might be something you're interested in, you can use the link down below to sign up for that. Also down below you'll find my Instagram and Wizio page information. So my Wizio is where I make all of my custom content, so pretty much those are all the links listed down below. And lastly, just remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. But now let's get into today's video. Hi! Thank you so much for meeting me. I am so excited to paint you. I just got new painting supplies and can't wait to get to work. Um, do you have any questions before we get started? I thought that we would just sort of jump right into things. Um, I'm just going to have you do a really relaxed pose and whatever, um, whatever you're comfortable with, like works for me, okay? I'm pretty, you know, low maintenance. I wanna make sure you feel comfortable. So first I'm just gonna start by putting this on, make sure that I don't get any paint on my outfit. And then we'll just kind of jump into things and see, see what happens. I'm really looking forward to painting you. Okay. Gosh. I don't know why I'm having such trouble tying this. There we go. Okay, so just take a seat there and let's just jump into it. All right, so let me get all of my very important tools out. Um, first, I have my color mixing wheel, which always comes in handy. by me and I'm going to get my acrylics out. It's a brand new set I just got so you should hopefully feel very special that I'm using my brand new acrylics on you. Look at all these colors. So beautiful. I can't wait to dive into these. this or not gave you like a full explanation as to why I needed you to be my model but I had hired a model from an agency down the street and last minute something came up they canceled on me and so I was left with no model and I have a project due on Monday. So, so yeah, so I was freaking out for a bit because I have a project due on Monday and I now was modeled less. So, honestly, out of all my friends, Just keep these in here. 
so I was freaking out because now I no longer had a model, but then I remembered that I have a friend that is a part-time model, and I thought that you really are just so incredibly attractive and, I guess, fun to look at, so I thought you would also be fun to paint, so I hope you don't mind that. I'll just be painting you, not actually you, painting the canvas, but I'm just looking forward to it because I feel like we have not hung out in the longest time, like between my schedule and your schedule, you know, there was a period that we were hanging out so often and um, it just makes me sad that we haven't had time for each other, um, so... Let's not let that happen again, right? Because I just think we get along so well, and the last thing I would want to do is let our friendship fall apart. So, I'll just add some colors, and then I'll get into painting you. In there. So beautiful. Oh my gosh, these colors are so bold and bright. I there's nothing better than getting some fresh acrylic paints to work with. And having a brand new model to work with too is always so fun. And I promise I'm gonna do right by you. I'm gonna make sure to capture all of your angles, shadows, and really work to make this one of my best pieces, hopefully. I have really enjoyed taking this class at um, the community center, and I just want to take it really seriously, so I want to make sure I do really well because there is talk of the person who does the best in this class being able to work with our uh, current teacher for their new project that they're working on. So that would be amazing for my career. I mean, that would be amazing because I would love nothing more than to and to really start to focus on more artistic things. Can you turn to the side? Thank you. You have such an amazing structure to your face. I'm not, not even just saying that. It's incredible. So so handsome. Okay, I'm also doing a little bit of background details as well. This may take a few sessions, just so you know, so we might have to meet up again, but good. Yeah, I have a pretty laid back summer schedule too, so that's good to hear. Do you like having your portrait painted 
think it's fun, right? Something a little different. And I mean, when you know you have a good model to work with, it makes it hard. Well, at the same time, it makes it hard for it not to come out beautiful when you're drawing something so already beautiful to look at. But um, then it also puts the pressure on because if it doesn't come out looking good, you know that you did something wrong. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but don't worry. I wouldn't have asked you to be my model if I thought I wouldn't be able to do you justice. I want to start doing the outline of your hair. While I was practicing last night in my sketchbook, I was took out some pictures that I have of us when we when we came with me to that party at my friend's beach house and that day trip we took a few years ago into the city. So I had so many pictures from both those events and a lot of good close-ups of your face. So I was practicing sketching you and it really, um, I think really helped me because I'm feeling a lot better drawing you right now than I think I would had I not done a little homework last night. <laughs> Don't get me wrong though. I don't really consider it homework because you have this very unique look to you that from an artist's perspective is really just pretty incredible. I want to make sure to really take my time on your hair because you just have such incredible hair that I really want to capture that. That really just makes you who you are. Gives you that very... <laughs> of course you can see it when it's done, but it's far from being done, so that won't be for a while. <laughs> I missed hanging out too. I'm glad. Glad you were free to be my human model, my human fruit basket. <laughs> Well, yeah, it's, it is a class. It's through the community center. Um, and I've been taking it since January. I'm thinking into looking into some college classes, but I just wanted to start off with a more laid back type course. And don't get me wrong, the teacher is really, really phenomenal. So knowledgeable. My brush strokes have already gotten so much better. Think of my hand, like, I've become a little lighter. I feel like a little more agile with my brush strokes, whereas before I noticed that sometimes I would press down too hard, and that's where a lot of my errors were coming from. But yeah, this course is like the basics, so I like to think I'm a little more advanced <laughs> than that, but it's still a good refresher since a lot of what I know about 
painting is self-taught. And I really want to get away from landscapes since that's a lot of what I know and get more into the human face, the human body, and just um, <laughs> no, we have not had any nude models, <laughs> but that's funny you ask that. Why would you be comfortable modeling for me like that? <laughs> okay, well, maybe some other time. I mean, I would be okay drawing you like that, but it's just not what I had in mind for today. Okay, let's see. Are you getting stiff at all? No. I'm trying to match your shirt to my color wheel. Okay, I need a little green. Actually, no, I need to add a little yellow to the green. I think that'll really capture your shirt. True. This has been really fun. You're comfortable? Okay, good. Oh no, I'm great. I'm having so much fun. Really? Good. Glad to hear it. Oh no. You can't see it this session. Maybe next session I'll give you a little sneak peek, but... It's coming along pretty nicely. I'm impressed. I told you, when you have a beautiful, when you're drawing something beautiful, it makes it a little bit easier to have a beautiful piece of art at the end. <laughs> yes. Well, you know that. I've told you before that I think you are very attractive, and out of all my friends, I knew if I was going to be asking anyone to model for me, it had to be you. You also just, I feel like I know you so well that your personality, I think, plays into the way that I paint you, if that makes sense. Um, I just, it's hard to describe, but from an artist's perspective, I guess it makes sense. I'm gonna let this dry for now. Um, it's kind of like layer one, it's like my, my base painting, and then we're gonna get a lot more detailed, okay? So maybe we can go get a sandwich or something while I let this dry, and you can tell me all that you've been up to.
yeah, since we, it's been a little while since we hung out, and I have missed you so much. I mean, how could I not? <laughs> oh, come on, you don't need, you don't need more compliments. You know how great you are. <laughs> you know, I mean, I've, I feel like I've told you one way or another that I've always had a little bit of a crush on you, so. It shouldn't come as a surprise that, you know, I would want to see you, talk to you, catch up. <laughs> and make sure that we never go this long without talking again. But sandwiches on me because you're sort of saving me since I almost didn't have a model to paint. And you're better than any, any model that an agency would have sent over for me. That I know for a fact. Thank you all for watching. I'd like to end this video by giving a special shout